Hello! Today I'm going to show you how to do a lip massage um, that would give you a natural, pouty, beautiful lips. Um, so to do this, we want to start with just putting some massage oil um, around the area. I'm putting my um, vitamin A um, repair and regrow concentrate. There's squalane, vitamin E, frankincense, um, and also uh, cherry kernel oil, which has got a lot of vitamin A in there as well. Rice bran oil. So um, a very, very light texture, but very, very moisturizing and good enough to help with moisturizing the area and even the lips as well and firming the skin around it as well. So the first thing to do, we use our hands. So we open up all the channels by um, pressing the acupressure points. Some of them are meridian, um, meridian points as well. So the first one would be here, just next to your nostril. This is called Yingxiang. Yingxiang is um, translated as welcoming scent. Um, welcoming scents like the smell of things, meaning that you're inhaling oxygen as well, welcoming air coming into um, the face. So here, you can use your second finger and then coming down to the line, just pressing and lifting it. And then under your cheekbone, by doing this, you will be bringing blood to the area. And then here, this is the chew muscle. Lift it as well. You don't need to put a lot of pressure. Really let the gravity do its job. You just need to poke your finger underneath it and then um, you will feel it to be slightly sensitive. But it's, it's right, it's the right thing because then uh, once you release your hands, blood will be flowing all around. Okay, so we've been doing here, 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 and then we can do around the lips, just slightly above the lips here. And then on the side, under. middle and just on top as well and then we use when you pinch our loops and if you've got a line that comes down here you can also pinch it. Okay, so this is a warm up. Then you take uh, one of our micro sculptors. This is model number one, which is called the Pick. You see, this is basically designed to um, pick the tendon. <laughs> um, and this, it can be a way of lifting. Um, and also um, for effleurage, for um, just comfort sweeping as well. So what we'll do today is to focus in this area. So to start with, we'll just massage the whole area. And for you to also feel what's happening around the lips. Um, I don't know if you'll be able to hear it, but then as I'm doing this, um, the fascia, the tissue around this goes I'll do one side and you'll be able to compare both sides. So on top of the lips, next to the nostril, side of lips, and underneath. Okay, with the spoon side. Then we do it with this side, same thing. Now, 
because this is um, slightly more pointier, you can divide this into two lines. So one, two, and then around the mouth. You would already be able to see that this side is poutier. If you can see the edge, and I can feel that this area, even on top of the lips, is um, hot. So blood is coming to this area. Then we use... Here we go. I am doing three lines here. So one two, three. And if you have a line here, I would suggest you go that and then go into the line and then massage a little bit. And then you can do slightly more just above the lips. So this side and the other side. Can you see the redness blood that's pumped through this area? And then same thing here. Okay, pressure would be mm, medium firm, I would say. You can do that. There's no point in doing that, really. You want to feel that your tissue has been kind of scraped over. Okay, and then close. And then lips again. So if you compare the two sides, this side is actually lifted. <laughs> Can you see? So blood has actually been plump, pumped through the edge of the lips and this whole side, you can be able to see this, has lifted. So yeah, and then to finish, just a very nice comforting stroke. I can't help but I will do the whole face just with this. Yeah, so that's pouting massage done. <laughs>